Hey, so in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can put your own Memoji or Animoji in the Clips app just to add a little bit of flavor to the videos you create. And if you're a little bit shy and don't want to be in the videos yourself, it still allows that personality to shine through. So let's jump into Clips. Here we are. Hi, everybody. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to start to think about how clips can personalize the videos we might be creating for our students. But at the same time, we really want to think about like people's anxiety of being on the camera. So it's great to have your voice. You might not always want to have your face, though. So this works on any um, iPad, iPhone with the true depth cameras. So the iPad Pros, the latest iPhones from the iPhone 10 upwards. And what you need to do is, first of all, if you tap on the star by here for your effects, and you'll see that you get the option of your Animojis by here, and then you'll get all of your different Animojis that you might have made, your Memojis all the way through to, to the, the animals, etc. Um, I'm going to go with my updated version, which has me with the slightly shorter hair than I'm used to. And you'll see that that now acts as your head. It does the tracking of your face. It allows you to blink and raise your eyebrows and open your mouth nice and wide and allows you to look around. So it's it's really, really good way of being in the camera, but not having to actually be on the camera yourself. Now, it doesn't end there. You can still also add the filters to this. So you can play around with those filters. I like this one, kind of, you know, kind of adds a really, really nice, cool effect. Um, you still can add all of your text. You can add in your stickers, all of these things, you know, just complement your videos that you're making and you can still add in your emojis as well. And these will, the same as they do with just your normal face, they will still do the facial tracking if you match it onto your face. So in my case, I'm gonna have the Welsh flag sit there next to my face as I am presenting. So there you go, nice and simple, using your emojis to create a really cool, personalized but slightly privatized video for your learners in your classroom. Have a go.